Shalom, Shalom, all praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Raka Kadash. Double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, broke a thumb to the hopeful elect. Shalom, Shalom. Back with one more lesson. This one is going to be entitled, If You Are Truly of the Lord's, He Will Lead You to His True Doctrine. And this is going off the comments last week. A couple of a couple people have made on the comment board on the uh, on the elder in Baltimore's channel, going into how you know he would hear other groups like ISUPK and IUIC talk trash or talk down on GMS. But you know. Eventually, the spirit was on him to to go out and check out GMS to see to see why these men were saying these things. And he ended up realizing that this is the truth. He said he's been learning ever since. And that testimony is a testimony that I have in myself. Because when I first came into the truth, I just didn't automatically go into GMS you know, you 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 go through the uh through the starter up camps. You know, you go through the through the stepping stone camp. So, you know, when I first came into the truth, I was watching IUIC and uh Sakari, partly partly Sakari, partly IUIC. Now, this had to be around uh I would say probably around 2017, 2016, 2017. So, this is kind of when the when the whole Deuteronomy 22 when the whole grape thing was was hot man it was hot so it was a lot of slander on the men of great millstone at the time because of the way that they defended the gospel you know IUIC was calling them you know grapists and things like that but eventually the spirit got on me to where I was like let, let me at least see what they're talking about because when you come into the truth you so new to the bible the bible is so new to you you got to relearn everything. You got to re-soak up everything, man. And eventually by by looking at looking at that uh that debate with Polite and the apostles, I just kept watching the apostles more and more and more and less and started watching IUIC less less and less, man. Cuz to be honest, IUIC that that is that is your mama's Israelite <laughs> group, man. <laughs> so would I say that when I say that, when I say that, that's your mama's Israelite group. That's that's if, if your mom came into the truth of being an Israelite, that's who she would go towards because that's more of a of a worldly image. That's more of a soft doctrine. You know what I'm saying? There is there's there's no harshness. There's no bitter to that. You know, Great Millstone, that is the group of your grandfather. <laughs> That's the group of your of your uh, of your forefathers, man. Because that doctrine has uh, zero band aid messages, as I did that video a couple weeks ago. There is you obviously gonna get the sweet, but you also gonna get the bitter. We're gonna warn you about Jacob's trouble. We're gonna warn you about the hell to come. We're gonna warn you about the karagma, man. These other groups, like I said, that is that is your mama's Israelite group. They're gonna tell you about uh, marriages. They're gonna tell you about how to how to have a, a a good, how to pick a good Israelite wife, how to have a good Israelite household. You see, hey, all, all that is irrelevant, man. Right now, what's important is this truth and the doctrine, and making sure these brothers and sisters understand what comes with that, man. But let me get into it. I don't want to ramble too much. This is uh, Isaiah chapter 49, verses 8. I'm going to read it both in uh, NLT and in KJV. I'm going to read KJV first. It says, Thus saith the Lord Yahweh, in, in an acceptable time have I heard thee, in a day of salvation have I helped thee, and I will preserve thee and give thee for a covenant of the people to establish the earth to cause to inherit the desolate heritages. And that goes into the last video I did going into the Wadi Hao by Shimiao Shai for the 12 tribes chart. Here we are inhabiting the desolate heritages. You know, before before we become, you know, New Jerusalem physically, we got to be that spiritually, man. 
before we inhabit you know before we're israelites physically <laughs> on the planet earth in the land of israel we got to come back to being israelites spiritually and knowing who we are but it says verse 9 isaiah 49 and 9 that thou mayest say to the prisoners go forth to them that are in darkness show yourselves they shall feed in the ways and their pastures shall be in all high places they shall not hunger nor thirst neither shall the heat nor sun smite them for he that hath mercy on them shall lead them even by the springs of water shall he guide them right and a lot of these camps man they may they may be able to quench the thirst but you're still going to be thirsty man you know it's, it's it's like it's like fucking gatorade man you 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 could drink a gatorade <laughs> right when you thirsty and shit you know you could drink a gatorade but end of the day that sugar in there that shit gonna have you still thirsty and and that's that's the sweetness of, of these niggas doctrine you're not you're not giving jake that full alkaline 100 percent pure uh living waters man you're giving him some bullshit ass you know kool-aid from the pack now that that may be able to quench their thirst for a second but there's not going to be 100 percent satisfied if if they are of the elect man if they are of the elect because you have you know you have members who are not of the elect that that love being in these camps you have members in these camps that just love going to the gun range and putting that on the uh <laughs> putting that on the on the videos for for all to see that's the example of your thirst not being quenched because the the doctrine and the truth alone should be enough that's why that's all we push you know great millstone you don't you don't see us posting party videos you don't see us posting rap videos you don't see us doing patreon subscribers all we do is push the truth because that's all you need to be satisfied these other niggas they need they need more than that man so let's read it in the nlt isaiah 49 verse 8 it says this is what the lord says at the at just the right time i will respond to you on the day of salvation i will help you and protect you and give you to the people as my covenant with them though you this is through you i will reestablish the land of israel and assign it to its own people again Oof, ooh, that's a cut to you j double o's it says i will say to the prisoners come out in freedom and those and to those in darkness come into the light they shall be my sheep grazing in green in green pastures and on hills that were previously bare since they will neither hunger nor thirst the searing sun will not reach them anymore for the lord yahweh in his mercy will lead them he will lead them to lead them beside cool waters you know and those cool waters is the truth man the real 100% without the Kool-Aid mixed in truth. You see? Now let's jump. 2 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 14. It says, Now thanks be unto the Most High, which always causes us to triumph in Hamashiach and make it manifest the savor of his knowledge by us in every place. Right? Because when, when the Lord is truly supping with you, that wisdom is going to show regardless, man. And a lot of these people, they they being shown to have oil leaks, especially, you know, them purple boys. When y'all try to y'all trying to uh, <laughs> bullshit that breakdown on that revelation, man, your savor, the savor of the knowledge is not being manifest. But it says, for we are unto the most high, a sweet savor of Hamashiach, of the anointed and them that are saved and in them that perish. To one we are the savor of death unto death, and to other the savor of life unto life, and who is sufficient for these things, right? So Apostle Paul is saying, you know, on one hand, we we the worst thing ever, man. Going going to you other Israelite camps, the way y'all portray us, the way y'all talk about us, we are the savor unto death. Uh, according to y'all niggas, we are leading people unto destruction, right? So it says 2 Corinthians 2 verse 16 to the one we are the savor of death unto death and to the other the savor of life unto life. Right on the right hand side the ones who are truly in the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai we know they know that we speak the words of life. 
regardless of how we are portrayed, no matter how bad we're talked about, the things that we are say, the things that we say have the potential to save the souls of of our brothers and sisters, man. And once again, that that is a matter of if the most high wants you to get this or not. Because if the most high don't want he if he don't if he don't want you to get it, he will have you out there doing uh fashion shows at the Passover. He will have you out there going to the gun range and taking videos, doing it on YouTube. But on the other hand, if the most high is really dealing with you, he will have you locked into the spirit of his true men and prophets. The men of Great Mill Salon down and one that teach likewise doctrine. No, it's not about the camps, it's about what's coming out of the camps, man. And a lot of you people have flawed doctrines. But it says, 2 Corinthians 2, verse 17, it says, For we are not as many which corrupt the word of the Most High, but as of sincerity, but as of the Most High, in the sight of man, we speak in Hamashiach. And the spirit of Hamashiach is prophecy. You see, we're not ones to corrupt the word of the Most High to try to trim trim our ways to seek love, to try to avoid certain topics in the Bible, because the whole Bible is relevant. The whole Bible can be used, not just uh, you know excluding the Book of Hebrews, not excluding Deuteronomy twenty two. No, all of that is relevant, man. So we are not as many which corrupt the word of the Most High. And if the Spirit is dealing with you. The spirit will bring you to, to that understanding, man. But with that, hey, Lord willing, this is edifying as well. All praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakwidash. Double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Brakatham, Tro Falek. Shalom, Shalom.